apartment go Yo, what is up guys? It is Furious here, bringing us back with another video. Uh, it's been a good minute since I last recorded a Z Zmodel tutorial. I want to say it's been like two months or so. Uh, hopefully you guys are doing great. Um, you guys have been suggesting a lot of stuff uh, in terms of tutorials and stuff. I'm trying to do those tutorials as well, but this is a big one that I really want to get out. Uh, it's pretty much environmental lighting. Uh, quick rundown what environmental lighting is. It's pretty much when you hit the lights, non-ELS or ELS, but this is a non-ELS tutorial. Um, you know, the, the reflections that it bounces off the walls, the ground, the streets, you know, that's pretty much what environmentals are. Uh, by default, when you just install like a non-ELS light, if you haven't rotated nothing in Zeman or in Karkos, it will always be facing forward. Uh, obviously, we don't want that because the rear lights, RL, they, you know, they're supposed to be flashing towards the back, but not the front, you know? So I'm going to be teaching you guys how to do the rear, left, and right environmentals. Uh, I'll have timestamps down below in the description. Hit that subscribe uh, button. We, we, I'm trying to reach a th we're trying to reach a thousand subscribers because we had a thousand subscribers that could like put the like the little timeline down below. But Lisa, yeah, I think it's a thousand subscribers. Hit that subscriber button. It definitely comes handy during, especially during these tutorial videos. Anyways, you guys are gonna go to the bottom of the description. Uh, there should be something called uh, links used in this video. It should take you to my non ELS guide, which I made back in spring of 2020. It's been a good minute since I last used it. But here, there's a section called environmental lighting. This is pretty much for this number right here is the number you will apply in the car course, which I will get to eventually. But yeah, so, and this right here is obviously Zemon, Zemon, and Zemon, uh, you know, per each category if you're trying to do rear. Then here's rear, if you're trying to do left, here's left. And if you're trying to do right, there's right. Uh, I'm going to start off with the rear environmentals. So, uh, first things first, you're going to hide everything. And you're going to select the sirens that you use on the rear, which was extra six. I'll, I use four sirens for the uh, rear bar as I made it, you know, not so um, simple pattern is a little more advanced, I guess you could say. Select all the sirens, and if you load them, just dismiss them to the point where it should look something like this. Uh, so in here, I call these meshes, and then obviously these are just the dummies. Hide the dummies, so pretty much turn off the box that's not inside of this you may you might have more science you might have last it's the same steps uh so another thing uh as it says here for rear uh, environmentals you got to rotate on the top view x and y to 180 degrees with pivot off so let's go ahead and do that you're gonna go to top view rotate make sure x and y selected oh furious uh i, I click x but then it turns off Y. Why is that? Make sure to click down here. It should have uh, a 90 degree uh, right arrow and this should allow you to select both at the same time. Select all of these. Make sure all of these selected. Sometimes it only selects three. So what I do is just deselect and deselect it again. It should select all of them. Auto off, pivot off, and then click on it once. Type in 180 in total. Click OK and that should rotate it. Boom, you're almost done, and then just go ahead and L LO them back again, L1, and so forth. Th it's pretty much the same process for the site environmentals. It's just a different view, and it's not X, Y, it's just Y, and also the number is different as well. In Zmod and the Karkos, oops, right there, messed one. So just go ahead and L LO these back really quick. I recommend allowing the vehicle to L3 or L4. This is just if you're further away from the vehicle, the lights will still be shown. But it's totally up to you uh, how much you want to LO them, of course. All right, there. Hide that. Boom. We got rear environmentals. Now I'm gonna open the, up the carcals. We're gonna do each, you know, each one at a time. So just open up your carcals. Meta. And here and what i do i with a different sheet i write down what sirens i use and you know the patterns and stuff like that so for the rear bar i use siren uh let's see i use siren 14 through 17 so just find your siren 14 and then the number right here that's pasted right here for rear environmentals just use copy that number and then down here where it says de flashiness under flashiness delta value should be all zeros 
replace it with the number you just copied from that document and then just go ahead and do that to all the sirens you use for the rear bar or you know not necessarily just the rear bar the light that you use for the you know rear lighting and stuff so I use siren 16 and then last siren 17 as well under flashiness boom that's done your set we now have rear environmentals uh, on that rear bar obviously there's more things besides that bar that are also in the rear that need to be changed I will do that after the video but moving on to the side environmentals for this vehicle I use side ions we're gonna start off with the um, left ions click yellow or right I should say so we're gonna start off with the right side so hide everything except the siren once again and just to verify this is the right side of the vehicle yes sir it is turn on siren 19 or you know you might have multiple sirens like I said dismiss them same process hide the top dummy but for the right you must be on the back view and rotate them right here back view on the y-axis to 90 degrees so let's go ahead and do that back view uh, select them why uh, just the y-axis select them deselect if all of them do not you know select make sure auto and pivot are off and then click once and type in 9 for 90 that should rotate it same process I'll load them again And boom, you're done. That's it, literally it for the right environmentals. And then we're going to open up our carcals that meter once again. Uh, and then we're going to copy this number that will go inside the carcals. And I use for the right side, I use siren 19. So let's go ahead and replace that. Boom, done. Now we're going to do the left side. So hide everything, open up the left side, find the ion for the left side, uh, which is right there. And then just dismiss Siren 18. Hide the dummy and just turn, you know, the just turn on the sirens that are inside the top dummy. Select them. Back view, still Y axis. Auto save, of course. We gotta wait for auto save. Alrighty, auto save is done. And this is what I mean. If you select it, this will select all of them. Just deselect them and then select it again. It should turn. Select all of those. Auto pivot once again must be off. Rotate and you should be on the y-axis back view and this time as if you look at the document it says rotate to negative 90 so we're going to add the negative sign I'll click that again so just negative and then just 9 for negative 90 done click OK and then LO once again so let's LO this L1 L2 and then L3 and then you can show all and then you could save this and then let's open up the carcals once again let me pull this over and then if you go back to document it's literally the exact same number uh, but it's just negative so this is this one was for the right this is going to be for the left so open up that and then for the left environmental we use siren number 18 so let's scroll back up under flashiness delta paste that in and you're done that's pretty much what uh, how you set up environmentals in zmod uh once again if you're still having issues join my discord you know obviously i want to make w one thing clear if you go into support channels and ask for support it's not 100 percent guarantee that someone is actually going to help you obviously support is all voluntary if no one has the answer then unfortunately no one can help you but we try to do our best as a community to help everyone who has any questions if you if this worked out for you make sure to drop a like down below subscribe if you're new remember we're trying to reach 1k uh just so we get that special feature of the timeline which comes handy during tutorials that was it um any other you know tutorial requests join my discord let me know in the comment section below or in my discord once again thank you all for watching this and hopefully this works out for you uh, have fun modeling.